Hello everyone and welcome to my basic combo video. So some of you thought that my combo guides were a bit too in depth. I wanted to make this video as kind of a quick start guide for the character. If you just wanted a few combos to get started, you were in the right place. In this video, I will go over Daisy's go-to combos, which will incorporate all necessary conversions you need to practice with the character. Please note that there will be no tech in this guide beyond that which is presented in my important tech video. Without further ado, let's get into this. We'll start with probably the most important combo. It involves the most common combo starter, an aerial into down tilt, followed by a ground float in air, and then a basic throw combo. This combo works on the majority of the cast, does a ton of damage, and is relatively simple to execute. If you can practice and perform this combo in gameplay, you're pretty much good for the majority of Daisy's combo game. Plus, practice also helps work on your ground floats and your confirms into down tilt. This next combo is pretty much the same as the first one, but it incorporates a few different techniques. One of these is the down air into drag down up air setup. It involves releasing float on the fourth head of down air, followed by an up air, and then into a down tilt. After the down tilt, you have the opportunity to do drag down up air loops, followed by multiple up air twos. These two combos feature most of the components that are involved with every single daisy combo, so practice them. This next combo is going to be what I like doing most with turnups at low percents. Note that everything in this string is true except for the first turnup into down air. It is still a good trap though, and can lead to a lot of damage if connected. Practicing this combo allows you to get a feel for how items work. As an added bonus, turnup into down air strings are very flexible. They work on most of the cast at a variety of percents, they work with a variety of different turnup types, and they even work backwards if the dare sends the other way. After the nair, you can choose to extend the combo depending on where you are on the stage. This allows you to incorporate even more item tech to get the hang of turnips, and of course deal more damage. Alright, does this sound too complicated to you? Alright, here's a very simple conversion you can get. It still does 41%, involves a ground float bear into down tilt, very common conversion, and then just choose your own F smash. Simple, straightforward, and requires almost no work, as long as you can hit the down tilt. This next combo is going to be back air, back air into dash grab, down throw, down air into up air. This combo is going to involve Diddy's banana on Rob. You start by throwing the banana, and then you grab and throw up, and they, they miss that tech, and then they neutral get up into the banana, you down throw, uh, down air, down air, forward air. Solid combo, 68%. Good stuff. This next combo is going to be similar. You start with the down tilt, uh, they miss that tech, jab one, um, the, the neutral get up into the down that you cut the video there uh, grab uh, down throw back air uh, of course they're gonna miss this tech too so you, you tomahawk them because they get scared and then down throw a, a, a jab side b and, and then side b for the kill this next combo will involve a turn up into nair dash attack dash attack again back air f tilt dash attack forward air this next combo will involve a left click, a left click, and a motion transfer, two to reset, and then another left click to get the kill. 